Hi Gemini, thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. Welcome back to Yonce's Universe, it's me Yonce. I'm going to be doing your November 2021 quickie love reading. This is your sex capade uh, series. We're going to see what could be going on for you in November. These messages are supposed to be quick. Okay, so they may not go into depth like regular general monthly love readings, but this is for November. It's your sex capade series. So, Gemini, check your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. We have the sun card coming out, Leo coming out. You could be dealing with the Leo. Ancestors and spirit guides, protect me as I go within the tarot. Show me clear on this message for Gemini. Return to sender any and all negativity and no FNS formed against each other. Prosper in Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Okay, now that I got that out of the way, Gemini, check all your other signs. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. This is for November 2021. So they can be predictive. Could have already happened. Could be happening now. Could happen in the near future. I'm time stamping this for November, but y'all know time is fluid. Gemini, check out your messages from your ex reading that I just uploaded. Check out the all signs reading. I have those time stamped. Gemini, check out the air signs readings that I have for you guys. Um... Follow me on all my social media, book a personal reading with me, like, share, subscribe. Your your support really does help my channel grow. Y'all know I'm trying to grow my channel, okay? And leave me a love donation, yeah. Purchase any of my spiritual bath sets, I'm open for personal readings. Ancestors, let's go. Let's go. I humbly ask, let's get these messages for Gemini, okay? All right. For Gemini, please. Ooh. Okay, this is what they said. High Priestess and the Eight of Pentacles. You could be dealing with the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, or an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Okay, so um, you're working on something that you don't want someone to know. Someone is working on something that they don't want you to know. They're keeping it on the hush. Okay, you could be keeping your relationship status on the hush. Maybe you could be keeping your sexuality, your sexual orientation on the hush. Okay? But whatever it is you're working on, and I see you could be in the gym as well with the three of cups. Y'all ha y'all having sex on the low. I don't care what nobody say. Now, this could be you and your brother's friend. You and your sister's friend. You and a, you could have a click group. You could have a group of people. Let's say it's five people. You and you know, this other person out of the five people are sleeping together. You don't want everyone else to know. Okay? You like this person. They make you happy. Ten of cups. Okay? They can have kids. You can have kids. It's going to come out that y'all are together because you're going to get pregnant. Ace of Pentacles. You are going to, one of you are going, is going to get pregnant or you're already pregnant with the high priestess. You're keeping it on the hush. Y'all are having a spirit child. Okay? Queen of Pentacles. This is, some, this is something that y'all want for a long time. Okay, so what the you're building a relationship with someone and you're keeping it on the hush. So when you be going out of town, you be telling them, "Oh, I can't hang out, girl. <clears throat> I'm sick." <clears throat> you got your whole bag packed and you going to go see him, or whatever it is. Okay, <laughs> that's what I see. I like it. Okay, yeah, Six of Pentacles and the Emperor. Now this person could have kids. I do see that this person could have children. All right, or they can have pets, okay? And I think you're starting to be okay with that, Six of Pentacles, because this person is able to still maintain a relationship with you and their children. Like, you don't have to worry about, like, what are we what are we all doing, you know, things like that, you know? You could be dealing with an Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, or you could just see this person as being in control. You like when daddy take control. Okay, that's what you like. Alright, or maybe you, Daddy. Um, Gemini, and they like when you take control. You could be dealing with, I see the Queen of Pentacles and the Emperor. This is something you want for a long time. You want to have a solid, stable connection with this person. You want to move in. With the Ace of Pentacles, you want to make that gesture. Ten of Cups, you want to blend the family. Okay? This the, the this sex capade y'all got going on. Just ready for you to go ahead and bet it all. Yeah, this the one. This how this this the energy I'm getting from the cards, Queen of Pentacles. So y'all could work together, or y'all could be wondering like how to start a business together. You could be you could you and this person could talk about 
finances together. You you talk about money together, Queen of Pentacles. You're showing them how to nurture or showing them how to build. They're showing you how to nurture or showing you're showing them how to build. Ace of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, okay? This is someone who has their own business or is devoted into making their money grow, finances grow, business grow, credit grow, you know, things like that. They they want their money to make money for them. Okay, ten of cups, three of cups. Okay, some of some of some happy cards in the deck. Three of cups could be a reunion. I'm just throwing it out there. All right, this person you don't see it. You don't see it yet. You said I I want the proof is in the pudding. <laughs> the proof is in the pudding. Okay, so I see you could be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Or an Aries, some moon rising of Venus. There is no fire and no air. So y'all probably are not talking. There's no fire here either. So this may be going a little slower. I don't want to, I don't know. It's kind of contradicting because we have the three of cups. Y'all, y'all is doing the damn thing. Y'all doing the do or this is just how they feel. Because like I said, there are no wands. There's no action. So this could all be how they feel. Because then the earth energy is very slow energy as well. Slower than fire. And then there's no there's no air energy. There's no swords. So there's I don't see any communication. This could all be just what you want. Someone is planning this all in the background with the high priestess. You feel that God is going to bless you with this high priestess? Because if this isn't happening, God is going to bless you with this. You don't need me to tell you that. You better believe God is going to bless you with this beautiful, wonderful love. Three of Cups, Ten of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. This is brand new, okay? So be expecting it. Be expecting an Aries or a Pisces. Or a water sign, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Anything else for Gemini? I just want to pull one card from the top. The hangman of Pisces. Okay, I see you're trying to look at things from a different perspective. You probably have some things tied up, some time tied up, some money tied up. Remember I told you some of you could have kids or your person has kids. Some things may be tied up, but it won't be tied up for too long because this person just wants you to be tied to them. So whatever they have to do to get you untied or whatever you have to do to get yourself unstuck, you and this person is going to make sure it happens. Okay, clarifying that, the justice at the bottom of the deck could be a Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. They want marriage. They want things to be balanced. They said, I'm going to do what I need to do to, to keep you, to keep you here with me. Look, it's a Pisces, the hangman and the high priestess again. Okay, be expecting, okay, this is for November, but if, if not, November, I saw the Queen of Wands, whew, we're going to get things moving between November and Pisces season, November, December, January, February, okay, I'm setting this for November, anytime between November, December, January, February, till we get to Pisces season, okay, <sighs> You could actually meet this person during their birthday. This Pisces during their birthday, okay? Let's see y'all sexy page. Y'all just keeping it on the hush. Y'all just keeping it on the hush. All right? Y'all could already have met this person. And y'all could be dibbling and dabbling in that, in that sex life with them, okay? Give me some messages for Gemini. November sexcapade. November sexcapade, please. For Gemini. Messages for Gemini. Okay, messages for Gemini. Who else got this? Who else? Sag you could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Sagittarius card didn't come out, but I saw the Queen of Wands, so that could be Sagittarius energy. I, there's some Sagittarius energy in there somewhere, okay? I feel, I felt that, I feel that. Okay, give me one more. Okay. It says, I want I want to be yours. I want to be yours. I'm telling you, this person, this person is going to make sure you're theirs. Okay? You're going to make sure that this person is yours. Okay? I want to be yours. You. Yeah, you. I hear, what did he say? This was Lloyd. He said, 
I'm going to turn you out. I'll show you out. Yeah, you girl. No, you girl. You girl. Yeah, you. Okay. Okay. So, your sex paid messages. I know I hurt you. And I'm sorry for hurting you. Whoever this resonates with. There's someone who's sorry for hurting you. They know they hurt you and they're sorry for doing that. That may be how you feel towards someone. Okay. All right. Sex is paid. Y'all getting that magical dick, boy. Y'all getting that magical dick. Y'all is giving magical dick out, okay? Damn. Damn, magical? Okay, I want to be with you tonight. Okay, I'm telling you, three of cups, ten of cups. Y'all is getting it in. This how so I want to be with you tonight. This is how somebody feel. I want to be with you tonight. Okay, they're obsessed. Oh, yeah, magical dick will do that, won't it? Oh, jeez, Louise. Magical dick will do that, won't it? This what y'all, November is going down. Someone said, right my face. Okay. Somebody, whoever this resonates for, could be a virgin. Okay. Maybe you lost your virginity to this person. Someone's a virgin. Virgin could be Virgo. I'll, I'll flip it like that. Or someone is just very innocent. Someone could be younger than you as well. Someone just looks so innocent to you. Okay. Someone say, I'm trying to get you pregnant. Y'all watch out in November. I'm trying to get you pregnant in November. Okay? They trying to get you pregnant in November. They pussy whipped. They pussy whipped. I like when you ride it. I like when you ride it. Ride my face. Blowjob. Okay? Getting it in. Blowjob. Give me a blowjob. Right right here, right now. I'm, I'm, I'm already I'm already out. Okay? I've already, I'm already out. Okay? Blowjob. We getting it in. Okay? I like when you ride it because I'm pussy whipped. Okay, and I'm trying to get you pregnant. Someone may be a virgin or someone is innocent, but some I, someone said, I'm going to get you out of being shy. I want you to come over here and ride my face. Someone is obsessed, and I want they want to be with you tonight. They got a magical dick. Okay, if they hurt you in any type of way, they know they hurt you, and they're sorry for hurting with you. Hurting with you, okay? They hurt with you, okay? <laughs> I don't know what that meant. They're sorry for hurting you. They said, I want to be yours. Okay, one last message. Oh, wow. They, look, this is what it say. I know I hurt you. I'm sorry for hurting you. I did it on purpose so we could have makeup sex. I did it on purpose so we could have makeup sex. They hurt you. They didn't make They sorry, but they did it so y'all could have makeup sex. I'm sorry for whoever I told on. I love y'all. Check the description box. Like, share, subscribe. See me in your next video. Bye-bye.